Let me take you for a spin Yeah, I'm your friendly Today we're answering a question that was sent in via our Facebook and if you don't follow us on Facebook, well, why not? Look us up, County Funerals. We're very cool. And uh, we're answering a question that was, how do you close your deceased's eyes? Now, this is a good question. In the movies, of course, all you have to do is wave your hands in front of some eyes and they close. In reality, it's not that easy, but um, it's not that hard either. Now, closing people's eyes, why do you want to close people's eyes? Why can't you have an open eye funeral? Well, after death, the eye goes kind of milky because you have a fluid that's right at the front of your eye. As that fluid goes stagnant, it goes creamy. So you end up with sort of a fish eye kind of look. And that's not great if you come in and say goodbye to your loved ones. So you close people's eyes. Now in the past, this was done by placing pennies over their eyes. And there was often said these pennies were for the ferryman. That goes back to Greek mythology when you used to have to pay the ferryman to take the deceased soul to the underworld. But more practically, it was there to keep the eyes closed when you used to come and see your loved ones. Nowadays, of course, we don't uh, leave pennies on people's eyes. We use eye caps and creams. Now, the eyes would naturally open because the skin dries out, the moisture leaves, so it gets firmer and it pulls back the eyes, the eyelids, exposing the eye. So a couple of things you can do to make the eyes really nice for when someone comes to view is when you do a removal of a deceased and you bring them into your care, if you put massage cream, some nice moisturizing cream on the eyes, first of all, when you come to do your facial prep, the skin is gonna be a lot more supple. And one of the things many funeral directors do, us included, is use these little eye caps. And we'll do some nice close up footage of the eye caps in a second for you. All right, they go underneath your eyelids in the same way you would have a contact lens. And you have some of them which are got little bubbles on, which hold the eyelid closed from the inside, and some of them which are smooth. And obviously it's the job for the funeral director, the undertaker that's doing the facial prep, um, to determine which eye caps is best for which disease in which process. And we also have another cream, which is like a massage cream, that we massage into the eyelids and then it sets nice and firm. And that will keep your eyes closed. Other ways you can close the eyes, some funeral directors use glue so they can put the eye, lid, the eye caps in and put a little bit of glue underneath and then close the eyes and then that will keep them glued closed as well. Um, I hope that's answered your question on how funeral directors close their eyelids. If you have any more questions, come on, let's hear them and we'll answer them for you. If not, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, it really helps us out. And we'll see you all again soon. Bye bye now. Well, I'm your friendly undertaker. Let me take you for a spin Yeah, I'm your friend